So today's video is going to be new makeup nonsense bingo 12, so let's just get straight on into it. So Too Faced have their Pop Tart palettes. They have their... A few moments later. They have their brown sugar cinnamon and their strawberry eyeshadow palettes. This is definitely food themed makeup. I'm not really majorly interested. I'm not interested in Too Faced. Like, I don't support Too Faced as a brand. Like, I just don't. Like, I don't even think their products are that good. Like, I don't think they look that good. Huda Beauty have their One Coat Well Mascara. I'm like, it sounds interesting, but I'm like, would I just try another mascara and just be disappointed again? Like, I tried the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara and I was just disappointed. So I'm probably going to say, uh, Drunk Me Would Buy It, because Drunk Me Would Forget How Disappointed I've Been In Mascaras. Natasha Denona have their Starlet Mini Palette. The colour story of it is so boring, like, literally. I'm not interested, I'm going to say, to that A Total Aim Palette. LA Girl Cosmetics have their duochrome shifter eyeshadow. Oh, 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 I'm going to say to that one. To that one. All the multi-chromes, because I'm like, wow, they look cool. Chanel have their 2023 fall collection. Mm, not sure. Kind of boring. I'm not really a fan of like these luxury brand fall collections, but I don't know. It would be someone call Michelle Wong, because I don't know about Chanel. Sneak peek, arriving in to the US for the Nordstrom sale. Dyson in Topaz, Airwrap Multistyle Complete Long. New Komodo Smoothing Dry, Re-Energizing 2.1.2 Airwrap Long Barrel. Dyson 1.6 Air Long Barrel, re energize Soft Smoothing Brush, re energizing Firm Smooth Brush, Round Volumizing Brush, Filter Cleaning Brush, Supersonic Hair Dryer. We'll start July 11th to 16th, Early Access, 12th to 16th, Ambassadors, and 13th to 16th, Influence Them for Everyone, July 17th to August. I'm going to say she doesn't even go here, like it's coming to the US. So, I'm not sure. New electric fan from Kim Shi Chic Beauty. Mm. Probably major copycat vibes because they do remind me of the Dyson fans. Michaela and Elf have a collab. Like, mm, not sure. Not interested. I'm going to say, I don't know. Probably a collab product that won't die because it sold out in 18 minutes. Like, that's quick. Toy Box brand created by Gerald Blandino and Jeremy Johnson, which also created Too Faced. Toy Box brand is a cross category integral. They are planning maybe two brands a year, and in the next 18 years, probably 16 brands. The two brands that are dropping in July and August, followed by a capsule makeup collection for Madonna's up and coming by the singer Sam Beauty. There's Diamond Drunk, including four different scents of non toxin daily jewellery cleanser for each you're my rock number 95 maybelline rain scent the year they met hello lover number 80 98 and rose the year they found their first business something blue number eight forbidden fruit scent the year they got married say it with diamond number 22 lemon drop scent the year they started Toy Box. Additional products will include cashmere, jewellery, towel and cleansing. Concentrate refills available on subscription every four months, $48. Will be available on August 27th on their website. Polite Society includes Glow Floss Yourself, a brush palette. Greatest flush of all time makeup. Big mouth lip plumping lip. Floss more than a pretty face. Skin Caring Foundation Egg Shape Bottle. Price range from this is in dollars. 
when $57 to $42 vegan cruelty free will be available on August 27th in 750 Ulta Beauty stores. Mm. Not interested. Literally a bundle that nobody wants. Give Me Glow Cosmetics have their butterfly vibes palette. This looks such a cool palette. Like literally I'm like, it's so cool. But literally, I say like, put it on my face because it's so cool. NYX have their Barbie collection. I'm like, this is nostalgic. We meet again. Like I remember Barbie in my childhood. Key Salon Care. It's light skin to in one concealer tint. Mm, never heard of this brand. Mm, not sure. Honestly, don't know. Probably would say same thing, new packaging, because I'm like, it's nothing different. Now we're moving into Colourpop. Have their Hello to Our New Wish Wear Here collection. Get Vasey and Ready Live Out to Your Wonderlust Dreams with the limited edition. All new Everyday Glam Essentials collection. This is inside Weekend Mood Press Powder Palette, which. A pressed powder palette means some of the eyeshadows in there, some of the dyes are not FDA approved, but they are approved in the EU, so take what you do with that information. I just thought I'd put it out there because some people are sensitive on the eyes and some are sensitive to some of those pigments, so take what you want with that information. The Phil's Pressed Powder Palette, Daydream Pressed Powder Palette, Pressed Blush Powder. Pressed highlighter powder featuring a never seen before polished finish. Ultra blot lip, mini shimmering dry body oil. Fourth Grey Beauty Strawberry Overnight Lip Mask Lip Scrub. Available now. I'm going to say Colourpop yet again. We have the new Viney Pop Colour Palette from... From She Glam. Mm, this does look like interesting. Not sure, really. Probably say if I was to buy it, I'm buying it for the science because I've never tried anything from She Glam. Isamara Beauty have their industrial collection. Not my thing, like it is an all shimmer palette and that. Gonna say she doesn't even go here because I'm not like that interested. Ulta Beauty have their makeup sets, coffee break, at the orchard under the stars. Each kit comes with a palette, stick highlighter, lippy lip liner. Mm, I'm not interested. Like I don't have an Ulta, so probably I don't know. I'm gonna probably say yes. Give us nothing. <laughs> I'm not sure. Laura Mercy have their rose gold highlighter, like every brand's been doing. Rose gold highlighters, mm, it's nothing new, like literally nothing new. Like literally, if I was trying it, I'd be buying it. I'm gonna say I'm gonna, I'd be buying it for the science to see what it's like. So if you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in another video. Bye.